Hey there everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So I am Viking Wizard. Gonna be unboxing Guardians of the Flame from the US Power Metal Band, the USPM, Virgin Steel, formed way back in 1981. And this one is was their um I believe this is their second studio album, which was released in 1983, anniversary edition, so Absolutely can't wait to get into this. All these extra tracks are cool. So you get some like bonus EP tracks and new bonus track, which um some of them I don't think I've listened to some of the new stuff, but the EP tracks and stuff that's gonna be cool to listen to. I've just literally unboxed their debut album, so that video is on my YouTube channel if you want to go check that one out. So yeah, let's get into this and I cannot wait. I'd love to see this band. I haven't seen them yet, so hopefully they come over to the UK at some point. But there's a beautiful artwork and I don't drop the thing with that beautiful sword. As you can see the back with the track listing, it's cool to see all the extra tracks. Now I actually don't have a copy of this on CD, the original pressing. So I'm gonna be looking for it and I wouldn't mind getting their stuff on vinyl. So it's a band that I'm gonna be definitely um getting more of their stuff i have the majority of their collection i think it's like three studio albums or something like that that i'm missing and i'll have a full back catalog so i cannot wait to get them add them to my collection but yeah that that back with the um artwork and everything that is absolutely awesome i'll show you the disc oh whoa there's the disc i'm actually saying oh whoa because Picture of the lineup from this era, which is awesome. I don't know much about the history of the band, so you know, members and all that sort of stuff. But if anybody knows, let me know in the comments. Have they kept the original lineup or have they actually gone through lineup changes over the years? I always say when I do unboxing videos, as I said in the last Virgin Steel and others, that I always say the lineup for this era purely because I know some bands go through. Um, Lineup changes more times than I've had hot dinners, i.e. Craig Lefilth, because I've been through gazillion lineup changes other than the singer Danny Filth who's been there from the start. So <clears throat> it's the only thing with the bands, with some of them that go through all them lineup changes is just trying to keep up with the names of the band members and all that sort of stuff. So there's the book. More than likely, which is cool to see all the photos and everything from this era. And you got the them the history and them talking about the album and the songs and that fantastic stuff so that's well cool some more lyrics i love it oh well i do love a good lyric book more lyrics oh cool lyrics That's cool credits and you get some um rest of the lyrics and some cool photos uh artwork or photos of the band which is cool on the back oh there's some more here that's awesome some of the live shots and stuff like that oh wow cool as i said in your other video i wonder if the, i wonder if they've actually um toured with man of war because they're another us pm you have some artwork which is cool so yeah this is ring virgin steel Guardians of the Flame, what a name for a song. Love the song title, always loved it. So, as I said in the other video, I'm gonna put a link in the description to this album. So, if anything piques your interest, whether it's the artwork or anything like that, and you wanna check them out, definitely go check them out. I can't wait to get into the all the extra stuff. The album is fantastic, but um, I'll probably say my favorite album off, the al off this release. I don't know if I'd say Metal Cry or, um, well, is it The Redeemer? Cause that's a great one but um some of them are anniversary remix songs or should i say the whole album other than the extra bonus tracks it's all anniversary remix which is cool so it's going to be cool to see what it sounds like i will be looking for the original pressing on cd so that's probably available on um discogs or something like that so i'll be looking for a copy to add them to my collection so hope you all enjoyed this i'm going to go play this now to see what i think of all the extra tracks and what the re anniversary remix sounds like. I do run a group on Facebook called Power Symphonic. 
there's a flag up there. It's dedicated to stuff like Virgin Steel, Gamma Ray, Halloween, Hammerfall, Omen, Nightwish, Sonata, Arctica, Stratovarius, all that sort of stuff. So it's for the genres of power metal, symphonic power metal, symphonic metal, epic metal, fantasy metal, neoclassical metal, traditional metal, off plastic metal, space, sci-fi, USPM, Prog Power, um, all that fantastic stuff. So it's all mainly fantasy and sci-fi related. But we've got over 7.5k members at the moment and we're growing the group more and more every day. So feel free to join the group. It's an awesome group. I'm constantly posting new stuff up there. So if you join now, you'll probably see some Virgin Steel up there from me and I've just posted, I believe it was um, some Hammerfall and Halloween. So hope you'll enjoy this. If you are new to this channel, if you would like to like and subscribe, hit that notification bell, all of that incredible stuff, because it's many unboxing videos I do, uh, as I, I always show unboxing videos, but then I show off my latest haul, because I've got like five CDs there, but I know the weekend coming, because it's, I believe it's um, Thursday now, gone straight out my ADH Thursday, um, so this weekend coming, my memory's a bit terrible, as you know. So this weekend coming, I've got a couple of stuff turning up, so I'm going to wait until the weekend and then I'll be doing the latest haul and getting a stack of unboxing videos done because I just haven't had the time with um, Power Metal Quest Fest. Then I went to the cinema to see Sabaton. God home was absolutely shattered, so I just about managed to fit a few videos in. So I'll be doing a stack because I'm off this weekend and I'll get them all added <coughs> to my YouTube channel to keep things still going with my YouTube channel. But yeah, many unboxing videos, but then I show off tattoos, gig reviews, talk about the bands I love, album reviews, show off my collection, and all music related. So feel free to um, like and subscribe and notification bell and all that sort of stuff. So I'll catch you in the next video. I'm going to go and listen to this one now. So have a good one. Like always, signing off and I shall see you later.